Welcome back to the After Hours podcast. Today I've got two special brothers with me. They were with me last week on episode one. We're just doing a continuation. Go watch episode one, come back. And if you've watched episode one, I appreciate you. If you've liked, I appreciate you. If you've subscribed, I appreciate you. We're going to be speaking about plenty of decent subjects that need to be touched on. Mental health being one of them. I've learned a lot from the brothers. They're going to be asking me some questions which uh, I'm not looking forward to. Going forward, we'll see where it goes, innit? We'll see where this conversation goes, man. But I've got a feeling we'll be learning along the way. So, um, welcome back to the After Hours podcast. But yeah. What was the last time you cried? <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah, nah. I cry, I cry, I cry. I cry, bro. Well, I cry. Cry out of laughter or probably? Nah, nah, I cry. I think I think it's it wasn't good. even that it's long ago. I it's cry, good. I cried this good. week, bro. Yeah, it's okay. good to a lot here. I cry. Okay. Yeah. I cry. Bro, I was about to cry earlier on when you were saying something. How about that? Yeah. You know, I realised. Oh, well, you actually did the music thing, bro. That was years ago, though. Yeah. Yeah. Bro, I was fully in it. Yeah. I was fully well, in it. If started, I carried on, college, remember college? Yeah, 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 yeah. College, I remember all the way till yeah. college day. Nah, nah. You know, you know it was. Yeah. It was so long ago that you know th- so many things, so many phases have passed by. But um, me and this guy we used to run around the same same ends, small youth running around and that. And it, you get it. But um, I've noticed as well we've had a lot, a lot of friendship um, circles, overlaps. Yeah. overlaps and circles in it. Yeah. But then uh, you know, how was the whole um, uh, that, that that aspect of life in terms of the music and stuff? For me, yeah. You know what? In at the time, it was it was good. Yeah. At the time, it was good. Riding the wave at the time. Yeah, at the time, it was amazing. At the time, it was so good. But um, you know, I had a friend on here the other day. Uh, not the other day. The f- my first video, Amma. Yeah. Where he was saying. Yeah, I remember him. Yeah, he was saying like you, you're on, you're on, you're on a high. From the from the um, it's like the Jack Wilshere game s- satisfaction of yeah 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 of, of of doing something you enjoy, um, but at the same time there's 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 I I didn't in hindsight looking back now I didn't like who I was, was yeah yeah or, or what who, came with it yeah or what came with it or who I yeah. could become yeah. in that in in that um, profession if you could say yeah because there's there's you, you you didn't agree with it morally yourself like you didn't. Yeah, I, it was never something that I thought is is something appealing. It was temporary. To. It was temporary, but then you can get so lost in it. Yeah. You you can't sit there and and write a song about a nine to five and 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 providing for your family. It was always something to you know what I mean. Nitty gritty, nitty gritty. Yeah, man. It was just honestly, man. Yeah. But but you're so lost in it. Yeah. You're so lost in it. Plus, I there's uh, Amara, Amara, He's from my ends. Isn't yeah, it? yeah, yeah, yeah. I, but I remember as a young boy, and the thing is, you know, what it is yeah. The problem is. Once you get when you when you're good at something, that's one thing. Yeah. If you're good at it, and then everyone around you is pushing you to be like, "Yo, produce more, do this, do that," yeah. because like it, you're you're actually it, good at it. Yeah. Or right? they want they're, they're telling you to do to do to do well in it because they want to hang on like just. But that's um, that hang on you to your coattails or just yeah, ride yeah, the journey yeah. with you. Ride the journey with yeah, you. Yeah, but at yeah, the end yeah. of the day. They found talent. It's like you find a footballer, tell him, "Nah, go for it, go for, go for it." Blah, yeah, blah. yeah, there is you know talent. I mean? Yeah, yeah. So yeah, there is that element of obviously they want you to become successful, so they can also come come up with you. Yeah, right. Yeah, and be like, "Yo, I remember I was your day one." Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. There's a lot of that. But the the, the, the only the, the only thing is with anything else, the way they supported you with that, if they supported you. In any other thing, yeah, you could, it's it amazing. Wouldn't, it wouldn't happen. It wouldn't happen. Yeah, but it wouldn't happen. It wouldn't happen. You get it. But when it comes to the only thing is, is the fact that you know what? It's we all know it's haram. Yeah, you get it. Yeah, but with 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 that as well, bro. If you ask me now, if you ask, and there was people that asked me, bro, when did you write this? I wouldn't remember. Yeah, wallah, I would not remember because uh, you're you're doing you're doing all these uh, paraphernalia and yeah. you're involved in all these. Uh, your brain is not even here. You'd write a song, good song. At the time, I thought it was good songs. You you'd re- re- record it, release it, put it out there. Someone would say, "Bro, that's a good song." How did you when, when did you write that? But it was me every day. I w- I don't remember. Yeah, I do not remember anything. It's like my brain is switches off, and you're doing something else, and you get into this mode. Yeah, you want to say the shaitan, but yeah, you, you don't. I don't know. Like, but I would I would advise people. 
to stay clear, especially nowadays, the young Somali generation, they feel like one or two is doing it, everyone should get on it. Yeah. Bro, this, these these media companies and all these, uh, all these, uh, what's the record labels, Predator, Predator. they're pushing Predator. for Somalis. Yeah, yeah, Bro, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's, that's scary. Yeah, it says a lot. I that says a lot. That says they're trying, they've done with all the other uh, um, yeah, races. Yeah, yeah. They're trying to ruin us now. We are fossil fuel. Yeah, but well, people don't understand it. They're yes. thinking, yes, they rate us now, finally. <laughs> yeah. Finally, they're, we're getting some ratings. Bro, you're not getting ratings, man. Ratings. They're just trying to end you. Exploit, exploit you. Exploit. Yeah. Exploit. That's the, yeah, they're uh, trying to end end the Somali now. Somali so if now. anyone's watching this, bro, stay clear, bro. They're coming for you. That's what they say in these movies, yeah? <laughs> the aliens are coming. What do they say? <laughs> what do they say? The spaceships are coming. This <laughs> real. <laughs> don't look up. You always don't look up. On Netflix. Nah, nah, yeah. You always don't look up. Please watch it, man. Leonardo DiCaprio. Like it's the end of the world. It's coming, <laughs> bro. Bro, they're coming for you, man. They're coming for you. <laughs> you know what I mean, guys? Bro, yeah, don't be fooled, man. Don't be fooled. But anyway, what's, what's, what's uh, we'll, next we'll for Scott? We're getting to Intas for Howie, and that's our personal collection. Yeah, 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 yeah. Jibril yeah. just threw us off there, man. Uh, I like that. That's our personal collection. Oh, yeah. But what's, what's next? And what, what's, the, what's the end goal for Scope? Would you say? That's a, it's probably a loaded question. Inshallah, to become an empire. Wow. Right, that, that that is the if we're dreaming big end goal, isn't it? Yeah, end goal. yeah, of course. Is, yeah. It, is there an end goal? It's going to keep growing. It, it will, inshallah, it, it keeps growing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The biggest thing it can ever become, and then it will still grow, and it hopefully <laughs> basically it will still grow. Yeah, it will still grow. That you know, it, beyond us. That's nice. Like I hope scope becomes this big thing that you know we're just founders. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do you know what I mean? And it's just uh, feeding itself and growing and and just. Like make an impact on the world, you know what I mean? That, that, obviously, that's a that's a vision, um, but wallahi, Allahu alam, you know, like you know, you just need to keep chipping away uh, uh, on it. The, the thing is, you know, different times, you're at different stages of your life, right? Mm. At the beginning, you have time, you have energy, mm -hmm. but no money, yeah. right? Then you get to a period of time where you have Energy and money, but no time. no time. But we're slowly getting to that time now where, you know, we have the money, we have the energy, but we can't squeeze 10 minutes in. Yeah, 10 yeah, minutes. Yeah. Time, time, <laughs> time is running time out. Is, time, time is, time time is bad, bro. Do you know what I mean? Time is killing and me, And then yeah. when you get older, if, if we have um, the, the time to live that long, you will have time and you have money, but no energy. So you want, at that point... Ship to be said, yeah, yeah you want it to be, yeah, yeah, yeah. To start roots, together, yeah. the roots I mean, to start growing uh, uh, itself. So, yeah, right yeah. now, we're at the crossroad where we actually have time, we have money, and we have energy. There's a small bit window yeah, opportunity. of a opportunity. We're slowly crossing over to Make got the money and energy, but no time. Mm. You know, too many things are happening in yeah, our life, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, like that. You, you don't have time to set aside, you know. What I mean. So whilst you have that small window when you actually have time, money, and energy, cafe there. So like, make the most of it. I think, we, bro. I think we should. I think we should start rating ourselves a little bit more, bro. Especially yeah. you guys. Six years of automation. You, you put your you put your head down. Yeah. What did my what did, what did the lady say again? You can't you can't be a doctor. Yeah. Well, I sometimes I look back you at know it. You know what I'm saying? I'm walking yeah, around in hospital. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We need to rate ourselves because yeah, 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 well, yeah, right yeah. now you're saying be an empire. Yeah. I think you can. Of course, I think you can. Somehow yeah, speaking to existence, yeah, 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 yeah. No, affirmation and stuff. We, we can, we are probably our own worst enemies. And, Downfall, know, yeah. Thinking about you know that's a bit, that's a bit too ambitious, you know. Yeah. That's a bit, that's a bit. But why not, bro? I feel like we're, we're, girls are better than us at, at that. I feel like men, we have a lot of baggage, a lot of problems. But uh, in terms of Speak on girls, that, bro. basically, girls, every step of the way, they celebrate every achievement, even like the smallest. They celebrate everything, really. Bridal shower, baby shower, wedding, birthday, regular, normal shower, uh, normal regular, shower, regular, regular, regular <laughs> shower. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? And you know what I mean? If you turn <laughs> like mandem, if you turn up to your own wedding, you're thinking, oh, okay, yeah, I, I need, need to, to get do over that. done with. But everything else, yeah, you need yeah. to do it because you're a man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Like, like everything is expected of you in terms of not, not from anybody, but society. It's like, you have you done uni now? Nah. What are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? Cause you know what I mean, yo, get get your money up. Yeah, you're still yeah. broke. <laughs> <laughs> you know I mean? You're still broke. Come on, man. 2020, bro. 2022, yeah, bro. 2022, <laughs> man. People are trying to hustle here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Here still Everyone's a millionaire, bro. What's going on? What's going on, man? You got a million. <laughs> <laughs> bro, yeah, leave the gun. 
was summer 16 and then what 17 18 2022 new you and then uh, how and many then new years bro s- s- slowly it's like whatever you achieve it's like oh well done like what's next you're getting married like are you, uh, are you starting a family or what once you start a family it's like oh, any kids nah no legacy yeah you're out here just walking about and uh, going on uh, bro, who these people you shit? meet, bro? Who these fucking yeah, who these people you meet, society. bro? That's Some what, evil that, people yeah. you bump into <laughs> daily. <laughs> <laughs> How many kids, bro? Why are you not on two? Why are you not on three? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's no, society, but I know you mean. I know you mean society, society in general. In general, but if it is the the difference between us and girls is they still get a lot of pressure. Even Sometimes more. Even, even more, more pressure even than more. us. Mm-hmm. But the thing is, they have mastered the art of every little success. They celebrate. They graduate. We need to have a graduation, a ceremony, party, whatever it is. Let's celebrate that. Do you know what I mean? What you, you finished reading the book, mashallah, you read the book, yeah? Say no more. Let's have a celebration for that. <laughs> you know, every little step of the way, they celebrate each other. They uplift each other, all of that stuff. For us, it's like, you've done that, yeah? Say no, no, Say no what, more. What's on the cards next for you, yeah, bro? You got like, in the back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well yeah, done, yeah. lad. Well done, well done. Nice one, lad. Yeah, yeah, nah, of course, of course, there's reasons, bro. Yeah, yeah, no, the reason. way we are, the way we're built. It's just how we are as individuals. But you, you yourself don't even want anything. That's the thing. You know, once you're done thing, you think, oh, Alhamdulillah, at least I can just chill for a bit of sleep. Yeah. Or you feel guilty for even asking for a, for a party or a celebration. You're like, you know what? You know what? I've I've done something. I should I should I should I should I should be celebrated. But you don't want to you don't want you don't want you don't want to say that out loud. It's deep down you're like, you know what, here's what it is. Let me just get move on to the next thing. Yeah, I'm like that. I'm like yeah. that. I'm that guy. Yeah. Because because why am I gonna you know not everyone's yeah, why, in the same why, yeah. not everyone's in the same Yeah yeah exactly. so why am I gonna brag or why am I gonna show off or why am I gonna get an evil eye from people that I love? Cause it's it's real man. Yeah. No no I understand that. But are you gonna suppress who you are and what you've done? But what if that's what if that's who I am? What if the quiet ones who I am? And I didn't know, and all of a sudden I'm finding out this is who I am, bro. I, I like this guy. I like that. I, I, yeah. hear that. I hear that. This is the guy I like, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, why but I know you mean. Why, I know you mean. Why you like that though? Why am I like that? Yeah. You know why? <laughs> because I've got a, I've got a, a large friendship group where everyone's doing good. Yeah. But this guy might have not gone to uni, so he wouldn't experience it. This guy might not be working. He might be uh, apprentice somewhere, which is good. So. So I feel like I don't know. I feel like. Do you feel like if you celebrate your success, you're kind of rubbing it off on others? Yeah, it or could showing be showing off on others. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like it's that. I know, and I feel like we're very apologetic. Oh, here we go. Yeah, you mentioned that before. Do you know what I mean? Why God? Like we're very Why God? <laughs> you got me alive. Yeah, we're Back very apologetic me, bro. about what people think and what people uh, like think of us and how they how it makes them feel. Because you're not saying, "Yo, listen, what you do in your life, bro? Like this is what I did." Come on, step up. You're not doing. You're not doing that. For example, if you bought a new car, you saved up for it. You saved it. last. You started this month. Yeah. Seven months now. You've 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 starved. Whatever. Yeah, I'd park it outside. I wouldn't even show anyone. Yeah, but hold on. <laughs> I know where you're going no, with but, this. Yeah, yeah. Would you? Uh, it's your car. You achieved it. No. But you wouldn't do nothing. No, You'd be no, like, no. you know what? Let me keep it away from eyes as much as possible. Yeah, yeah. I'd probably Just walk. Park I'd, it, park I'd, it I'd, I'd, I'd even if I'm going to, yeah. I'd I'd walk to the shop and everyone's gone and go back in the car and go home with it. I'm not. I'm not disagreeing. But what I'm saying is clearly there must be something wrong with that mentality. There's no shame. Where where did it where did it come from? That's what I want to get to. Because you know what? It's not about where did it come from. I just feel like it's humility. I think it's a humility thing. I think I don't think we're just gonna scream and shout and say, "Yo, I just finished uni." No, bro. no, 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 no. But what are you, you doing, bro? You take okay. <laughs> but look at that. Look at the sentence difference. Though. No, no, the, the, the first stream he had to go no, to no. to give that example. No, 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 no. I just added the. I just added the last part. I just added the last part. Wait, look, at the, look at the sentence different though. I finished uni. Stop there. Well, no. No, I did not have the joke. I did not have the joke. Also, but also, yeah, I did not have the joke. But also, celebrating could be. You know what? I finished uni. I'm taking one month off. I'm going holiday. A celebration yeah yeah you understand and no one needs to know about the fact that you you went on holiday because you've graduated but you're celebrating your success you understand it's just that our mind takes us to that extreme where we think oh what do people think am i right but this just them? goes back to this goes back to me saying you or both of you but i was saying it to you before um have you changed your friendship groups because they don't understand what you've gone through yeah. now that you so when you graduated okay you both had a massive uh, graduation I've seen as well I've seen yours With people that became doctors mm. Six years mm. down the line You've all done a six year stretch together Yeah You come back home Are they going to give you the same feeling As the other guys 
Yeah, hundred percent. Like you know, they, the first they, person they, they didn't they, they didn't understand the struggle yeah, you went yeah, through though. Hundred percent. No, no, they didn't understand. They didn't understand the first, it. The first person that called was Ahmed Goli. Yeah, he he, he picked up the Your phone. Names. <laughs> but he's the first person like that called me. Like I grew up with him, innit? Yeah, the yeah. first person that called me and said, "Listen, bro, well, I always knew you could do it." Yeah, yeah, yeah like you know mashallah, like, mashallah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Not only, not not just mashallah. He was there, like, listen, you always had that personality type, like that you were destined for it. Yeah, okay, fair enough. Do you know what I mean a phone call's worthy? I think a phone call's decent. It's decent. But you know, is, he, is, is he gonna is he gonna is he gonna celebrate the way you did with with Lempa, for example? No. Do you know what I mean? Of course not. Of course not. So that's the point I'm making. If I'm going through a university thing, I'm not gonna celebrate it with someone I just dropped out. Still my boy. No, but, you, but you, I'd rather just keep that hidden, bro. But, you know but what I mean? No, no, but. The, Let's define celebration. What, what what are we doing to celebrate? We're not holding a party, like. Well, that's I'm, what you said. No, no, I thing. know. I'm saying girls. That's what girls do in every step of their way. No, 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 no. But no, what no, I'm no. saying is for us, man, them, you know, bro, like, taking time out and being like, you know what, yo, I actually achieved something. Well done, Abdiftah. Like, well done, bro. Well, well done, Jibril. You know what? Maybe you deserve a new watch. Yeah, no, I'm not like that, mean? bro. Like, I'm not like that. Yeah, I don't care, bro. <laughs> That's what I mean. Honestly, I'll go back to it. I'll just say it simple. I don't care. I'm about to finish my masters. I told you. Yeah. I don't care, bro. Yeah. But it doesn't. It, I don't care. Where does that come from? I, it doesn't. I don't know where it came from. It probably came with maturity. No. Yeah, then, no. Nah. It came with idiocy. Then. <laughs> no, no, no. It's not I don't know, bro. I, I don't know. Like, I like, feel like it's lived experience. Trauma. Trauma. PTSD. PTSD. In the hood. <laughs> All that good stuff. But <laughs> well, you know, I think I think Boral is very. Um, selfless person, mashallah. He, I think he puts other awesome. people before himself. Yeah, you put, you put other people's feelings. I would rather that. And you consider you before you make before you put yourself first. You put everyone else's feelings. You consider what they might think. You might think. If you consider what they're gonna feel it, if I do what I do. So if I they, they might turn around and say, "Bro, why didn't you tell us?" Like we should have gone out. Yeah, I don't want there to be a split second where they look at me and think, "Yeah, I shouldn't have dropped out, bro." Yeah, you don't want that. So yeah, you're, you're you know what I mean. Considerate. And you know what, bro? Like that is a very like noble, uh, you know, the way of looking at things. But you can still, bro, celebrate yourself and not have to yeah, feel yeah, guilty and be humble. Yeah, be, yeah, be, yeah, but not feel guilty because what you're saying now, oh, that you, you're gonna feel bad for that brother. Think oh, I shouldn't have gone to. He's, you might think that he thinks. That he should have done what you did, and that's gonna make you feel guilty, sir. Yeah, no, no, just, yeah. just, just put it in hindsight. He might think, "Damn, if, if only I just stuck at it." But you want to prevent that from happening, isn't it? Uh, yeah, I would rather, I'd rather so it not. I would rather it not. Then, but no, no, but, but not just, not no, just no, unity, not, not, not yeah, just yeah. uni in any way, in, 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 in any way. I yeah, understand in that, in but your existence does that. You know the fact that okay, do you feel guilty about the fact that? No, you, I, I, but I would, I would mind celebrating. Don't get it twisted. I wouldn't uh, mind celebrating. No, I'll, no, I hear that. No, I'll book a restaurant and celebrate. Hold on, hold on, hold on. But I'll celebrate with the man that I just graduated with. No, I hear with. that, I hear that. But do you feel like the thought of you doing something and some guy that you grew up with didn't do it and then you just celebrating, obviously he's going to feel some type of way. You know what? Let's get it. Let, let, no, let me, just, let me just say real quick. Go on. I wouldn't... The thing would happen. Yes. The restaurant would happen. It would okay. get booked. Okay. It's not like... I'm going to fight people and say, yo, come, come through, blah, blah, blah. It, it would happen. It yeah. would happen. And yeah. if it was to happen, I'll invite people that I'm close to. Yes. But I would, I would rather it didn't happen. I, I, if it happens, it happens. I, I would rather that. it didn't. Why, why? No, but why? Why? That's oh, the question. Go on, ask it, go on. Why? Why? Okay, forget, forget, forget everything, yeah? Yes. Forget, forget everything. Right. Let's go back to, to the main thing. Yeah. I don't think... You're not that type. No, I don't think really? it's. I don't think it's a big deal. <laughs> I don't think it's a big deal, bro. I honestly do not think it's a big deal. Maybe at the time, maybe at the time, it comes. It comes at a different time. Maybe at, if it was a few years ago, it'd be different. But I feel like there's more important things than for you to celebrate your masters. Okay, okay. I feel like maybe uh, uh, at the time where I'm at now. Is there anything that you're proud of that you've achieved? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. Okay, let's not name them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, now. To change the place of the masters for that thing that you achieved, would you still do it? You know what? I'll be honest with you. I'll be honest with you. I wouldn't. It's just who I am as a person. I, there's a lot of things that I I should care about, but I I just rather I'd rather just care about it in here. No, I don't want to celebrate that. No, no, it and no, scream I it out. That, I hear that, but that that stems from somewhere. That's what we're trying to say. I, it doesn't stem it. from anywhere. It probably 100% it does. <laughs> what I'm saying is, uh, you know, what you were saying <laughs> to us, Doctor Phil, <laughs> <laughs> bro, this is mad. You know, it's okay. Ten minutes ago, you said you you lot you lot actually have done big, yeah, 
Yo, you lot should be proud of yourself. Is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you yeah. hearing what you're saying? Yeah, yeah, I'm hearing what I'm saying. Okay. Cause. Now, but this is how we are to ourselves, right? And this is an article I wrote maybe two weeks ago. Yeah. I seen it. I seen it. I seen it. Should don't, I achieve more by now? Yes, yes, yes. Right. Uh, uh, why? Then, why should I? Why? Sh why have I not achieved? Yeah, enough by, or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. More by now, right? Yeah. And that's how we are to ourselves. We are so harsh on ourselves. Mm. You will celebrate everyone's success except yours. You're thinking, yo, allow me, man. Like, don't worry. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like, and that's how we all are. But clearly that must come from somewhere. Yeah, I don't know. Do you know what I mean? And uh, obviously, like, I don't know if people agree. You know, I think, lads, we all need therapy, mate. <laughs> yeah, I think. This is therapy, man. <laughs> yeah, I don't think we need therapy. I think we're, I think we're all right, man. Yeah, yeah, no, 100%. I think no, we're all right, We're man. not saying there's a problem here. What I'm saying is, Everything is a lived experience. It comes from somewhere. You understand? Like the, the reason why we think like this and we don't want to celebrate anything, part of it is because we're guys, right? It's just that, show sure, man, we didn't grow up like that. I think you know, like think it's expected from us. Yeah, no, no, like even you know, birthdays, bro. If you give me a gift, I, I feel more weird. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you give me a gift, then yeah. if you just say, "Yo, bro." More life, inshallah. Happy I, don't birthday, like, I don't even like that one, bro. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah. but no, I'm saying if, if out of the two, yeah, 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 yeah. Like, I rather you you just say happy birthday than yeah, give me a gift. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, but if you give me a gift and all that stuff, I, I feel like. Are you the same? <sighs> bro, yesterday, well, my birthday, innit? Oh wow! The man, them, uh, <laughs> we, we went out to eat, yeah. and then um, I paid for it. I was like, bro. You pay for my meal. Oh man! <laughs> but that's that's just, you know what I mean. But I didn't I didn't even expect that. You get it? For us, is it's not even a note. So it was all three of us thinking like that. Then yeah. something needs to be. Yeah, something <laughs> needs to be. <laughs> yeah, something needs to be addressed, bro. Yeah, yeah, like you know, people say, "Yo, yo, big big three O in that." Just what you do? I'm like, come on, bro. I just got a trim more. Like, that's about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's not a big deal. So right? it's all three of us thinking like that. Yeah, yeah. yeah, you need to stop grilling me, then, bro. No, but what I what I want to get to the bottom of it because obviously, even for me, it's the same. Okay, it's like, okay. where is it coming from? Do you know what I mean? Like, because obviously we all think the same way. We don't celebrate our successes, large or small. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Where does it stem from? Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Because uh, like you can bring another five guys here and they'll probably say same, same thing. Same thing. Then it's like, obviously uh, we're built different to, to, to women. But the, uh, the thing is, there's also a reason why they're healthier than us mentally. Like mental health, most mental health, uh, like suicide or everything, depression, it, it hits men more than it does women. Let's talk on that. Let's talk on that. Do you know what I mean? So it's like, clearly it's having an effect. Yeah. A long-term compounded effect. Yeah. We're, we're, we're holding things in. Compartmentalizing. Like, you know, the, these yeah. things. Pushing a lot of boxes. Building up, building up, building up, building up, building up, building up. We're putting in a tough facade for so many years and all of a sudden, somebody, oh. somebody cracks it. Bro, that is, it's, it's, it's like that. So what I'm saying is... God damn, boy. <laughs> bro, this like, went left, cuz. Well, yeah, like we keep a lot of stuff bro, in. Bro, have a conversation <laughs> with some doctors, bro. <laughs> <laughs> this is therapy, bro. <laughs> now, this is therapy. We keep a lot of things in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot of things in. And if... The thing is, if someone gets it out of you, you think, bro, where did you get that from? Where did you pull that one out, bro? Yeah, yeah it's a rabbit in the hat. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, listen, all you do is joke, man. You're like a clown, like... I didn't know that you had all this da deep down in. You know what I mean? Like, is this how you feel type of thing? Anything? Yeah, 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 nah, yeah. nah, yo, relax, man. That was uh, yo, on to the next thing. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, you yeah, just yeah. switch the mood again. And you will never clock, bro. bro like, you will never clock. There's one guy that might be joking and friends with you. You think life is him. It's Christy. Nah. All of a sudden, you know, God forbid, podcast, you know what I mean? I don't know if you saw that, that this Asian guy. Yeah. A few months ago, he probably on Instagram. His name was, you know what I'm talking about. He, had, he left his car. He left his car behind seat guy. Yeah, seat yeah, guy. yeah, yeah. You saw the post. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, do you know what I mean? I'm sure a lot of people probably read that caption and could relate to it. Yeah, I'm yeah. the guy that is the loudest in the room that jokes around the most, but I've got all these bottled up feelings. And you know what? There's no other way to go about this, but I, don't, I can't continue anymore. Mm -hmm. Simply said that I can't continue anymore. And, but what if he, you know, what if. Open or spoke in, about. Any intervention before that, you get it. So, how are you? The thing is. For a lot of us, there needs to be. We need to save each other, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just have d deep conversations, because yeah. listen, what is our most uncomfortable thing? Our most uncomfortable thing is, bro, how are you feeling, man? What, like, how are you really? You know what I mean? Then you think, yo, my head is gone. What do you mean by that? Like, where do I go from here? Like, 
my easiest answer has always been, yeah, I'm good, man. What are you saying? Yeah. Do you know what I mean? But when we really, everyone's going through issues, everyone's going through stress. There's so much expectations. There's so much load that you're carrying. And we don't have like an outlet. Do you know what I mean? We don't have an outlet where we talk about things, where we talk about struggles, where we talk about the pressures of society. We talk about all of these things. And then all of a sudden, you're meant to put on this front and just be that man that, you know, uh, does everything and just like lives life and, and, and helps the people, intervenes, all of that stuff. But it, it takes a toll on everyone. You understand? Like you, you're, you're, you're a human being. You know, you're not built from anything different to someone else. You know, we're all human beings. And it's like the, the best thing we can do and the, you are who your friends are. Uh, and the thing is, like, you need to kind of... Support system. Yeah, you need to have the support system where you can be vulnerable around your friends. Do you know what I mean? Where you can be like, you know what, these days, bro, I've been struggling with X, Y, Z, you know. I don't know what to do about it. Just this is what I've been going through. Some real stuff, bro. You get it? And, and, and that itself is a start. We're not saying let's save each other and intervene and, you know, let's have uh, therapy groups and this and that. No, it's not. Even, just having deep conversations. And then after that, you can go back to taking over the world if you want. Yeah. You know I mean? sure they have like a safe space because how do mandem friends uh, usually um, develop? We like bantering each other. We like to, you know, joke around. Take, Roast each take, other. Take yeah. a piece of each other, whatever. In it. So you know, might not be comfortable Revealing something about yourself that one of the other boys can use as a weapon later to kind of grill you. I'm you get a, so that kind of culture has to kind of like it has to be like an understanding where you can banter about mining things like oh, yo today your shoes are looking dusty, fam. What are you playing at? Or and then later on taking about talking about yo, you know I'm going through financial issues, or whatever. You know what I mean? And respecting that that fact is something that we need to discuss or you know just have a conversation about, but not to be brought up in any kind of jovial manner. No, I think I think that goes down to I think that goes back to time. We might not have time to have that one to one conversation, bro. Mm. You keep you keep going out with the same people, the same places. There's no time for you to have that one to one conversation. So I would say make time to have a, to have a, like an honest conversation with someone. Yeah. Most of the time, <laughs> you go out, you go out, your friends come, you go to a restaurant. Before you know it, it's about five guys sitting around you. So you're not gonna have the time. Yeah. T- night's over. You probably driving, drop him off, drop him off. You get dropped off second. You want to have a one-to-one conversation. Or you're driving, he's driving. Car park, last time you see each other. Yeah. Bro, sometimes you, you need to have that time, I think. But you have to have time. You, uh, you yeah, do yeah. have, there are those rare rare occasions. No, there, there are heart to hearts, but they come so sparingly that mm, you think. Mm. Sometimes you, you, something happens, blah, blah, and then you hear, yo, yo. Like, yo, I've, I've been chilling with the last few weeks, man. When did he get divorced? Oh shit, some stuff like that. Do you know what I mean? Like That's sometimes right. these things happen. Or someone I mean? else tells you, and you say, what? I was with him every single day, bro. bro I was with him, bro. We're cracking up every day. He lost what his house, yeah. Yeah, he lost his house or something happened to him yeah, or yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah, He's yeah, going yeah. through financial difficulties and you're thinking, listen, does it take anything away from you? Does it take away from your manhood, right, to open up? That's the real question. Mm. Uh, as a man, does it take away from your manhood if you open up to... A small group of people. You can't be like, hey guys, uh, grab a mic to the world because that's not how we work, can it? But to a small group of people that you trust to open up and uh, up to them and open up to each other. Like, it's not like one person has more, like one problem and everyone else is like just intervening and not talking about their their problems. You know what I mean? Everyone has issues. The line of questioning is like interview, bro. <laughs> Towards me, man. But yeah, well, like, no, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. It doesn't take nothing to open up. But it does take, I don't know, I feel like it takes a bit of courage, bro. Definitely. Mm. You know what I mean? It takes it. It's, 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 about, it's yeah. about that first step because you never know, man. One of your other close friends might be in that point where they want to open up as well. But, you know, if you take that first step, and like, you know what, bro, like, guess what, bro? Like, you know, I hear what you're going through. That's mad. But, you know, I'm, this is what happened to me as well. You get it? And then that's another way you can also bond over, you know, have a conversation about it. Just, bro, even like talking about things. It's an outlet, bro. Just, just, just vocalizing it and you know putting it into existence because you might be your own worst enemy. Mm. Um, say, you know, repeating the same thing in your head, yo, this is a bit mad. But if you say it out loud to someone that you trust, um, they might say, yo, bro, like, it's not, you know that that situation is not might not be as bad as you thought it would be. Mm. And even you just saying it out loud, you're like, oh, you know what? It sounded crazy in my head, but now that I say it out loud, it doesn't. It sounds okay. Yeah, yeah. you get it. 
that can help you out as well. And also girls, girls like there's so much we can learn from them in terms of like being intact with their emotions and you know how to uh, just open up and all that stuff, right? Talking is is part of therapy. And how many times have you seen where like a female relative or a girl is talking and you're out here ready for the solutions? Like you're thinking point one, okay, that you can do this about this. You can do this about it. But they don't want to they don't even want a solution. I think a mesh of fuddy they get certain. Like you just sit there and listen to my problems and once they've got everything off their chest, they'll be like, All right, yeah, that's good. I'm 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 over it now. Yeah. You're thinking, you know, what, what? This man, I didn't even need your solution. I already know what the solution is. I just want to get it off my chest. Get it off the chest. You know that that weight. But for us, we find that weird because that weight is normal. Be- that, that's our normal weight. Yeah, that is weird, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah that for us, that is weird. But for, yeah. for, for, for girls, they can't hold that weight. They're thinking, nah, man, it needs to get off my chest. For us, it's like, yo, I've been carrying that kind of stuff my whole life, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? I'm used to that weight. That's normal for me. So if you're telling me get that off your chest, you're thinking, no, I'm all right, man. I'm good. Thank you. Don't worry about it. Mm. Do you know what I mean? So Did you say it's 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 probably more like a, f- a female trait than to open up and stuff because they do it so naturally. Let me just put, let me just cut right there. Look, you just said it. You said it's a female trait. Is it? Is it? Pause. Pause. By you saying that, you have to automatically. Not for maybe for yourself, but you know, generally, had it, if someone was to hear that, I don't like opening up, bro. That's yeah, what I'm yeah, saying. Yeah, nah, nah, yeah, nah, nah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Had it now, you easily like told yourself, I don't need to do that because it's a female thing or, or it's a girl thing. I'm no, no, I'm asking you, bro. You're no, no. professional there. No, I'm not. I'm would not. you say though? Yeah, would I say? I wouldn't say it's a female thing. I would just say women are better at doing us than men. But it's a general thing. Okay, they've mastered. Yeah. They've mastered it more than we have. Like, as soon as we paint it as a feminine trait, we shy away from it. Like, that's not us. No, it's not a no, random no, thing. We no, don't do I'm that. I'm just saying. I'm no. just saying. Yeah. Yeah. Would you say it's a female thing? No. 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 Everyone has emotions. Don't you have emotions? Nah, nah. Cyborg and that. Nah, I do, I do, I do. Yeah, you do. Cyborg and that. Cyborg and robot and that. Emotions, what? <laughs> What's that, bro? I can't say, I can't say that. <laughs> but, like, no, no, no you're speaking some real stuff. We don't know how to handle our emotions. We do. We just don't have to handle some emotions. I think some, some, yeah, yeah, yeah. some are just like what's all this. Happy, sad. We know how to do it. anger. Yes, frustration. Yes, yeah. Doubt, grief, worry, anxiety. I don't know what they are, bro. I'll be honest with <laughs> In you. In my dictionary, they don't, they don't exist. There. I'll be honest with you, bro. <laughs> nah, nah. That's you know yeah, what I mean. Yeah, I should, yeah. I should, I should. But yeah. When was the last time you cried? <laughs> nah, nah, nah. I cry, I cry, I cry. I cry, bro. Well, I cry, cry out of laughter. Or nah, nah, I cry. I think, I think it it's wasn't good, even that long ago. Allah I it's cry, good, I cry this good. week, bro. Yeah, it's okay. good. Allah I cry. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I cry, bro. I was about to cry earlier on when you were saying something. How about that? Yeah. Wow. I was holding myself. Yeah, I no, cry. I do Allah cry. Allah. Okay, okay. Bro, the thing is, that cry. itself is a good. Yeah. Uh, How do you feel about saying out loud now? Nah, nah, nah. You know what it is? I used to be before that. Like, I don't cry, but I've cried so many times that it's. I can easily say I cry. I cry, bro. If it's important to me or if something means to me, if it touches me, I will cry. Yeah, I'll cry. Yeah. I'll cry. If you say, if you say, literally right now, if you say the right things to make me think about something, I'm crying, bro. Tearing up. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm crying. What about you two? I don't know. If it was, was it a question you want me to ask you back? No, sometimes, yeah, why not? Why not? sometimes you why get not? me. Yeah, yeah, what not? about you two, bro? I think I watched the movie still. Nah, don't say nah, movie, don't bro. Nah, nah, don't do it. movies, People bro. It's real life, man. Here, man. What's wrong with you, cuz? <laughs> no, nah, man. Nah, 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 Notebook nah. thing. On, on a real, though. Don't say nah, movie, bro. On, on a real. Okay, I did. But I'll tell you another instance. The prior movie time. But I'm, I'm trying, trying to, to let it slide. Uh, uh, I, yeah, movie, like bro. a banter thing movie. Uh, bro, nah, it's real life we're talking about. No, but for real, it was a good movie. Anyway. What movie was it? Sorry, I should have asked that. What movie was it? I think 1917. That's the world, war one. World, world, one. The world war, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mad, God, yeah. Anyway, yeah, no. Um, God, what about you? I know it's a notebook, man. Don't try it. <laughs> yeah, I know you're saying like that, bro. Yeah, yeah don't try yeah. it, man. Oh, well, it was, um, you it was see how he's preaching, 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 yeah? About, you know. No, no, no. He cried, bro. I the can when see, was the yeah. last time he cried? Well, I was recently. I'm not going to lie to you. Yeah, I can okay. see, bro. I can oh, see. What about you? Well, I hey, two, two, three weeks ago. Yeah, yeah two real, weeks ago. real, 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 yeah, yeah. Real, 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 yeah, bro. Crying. I even, I even cried when I graduated, man. Yeah, that's but, a bit mad. But I cried because I was overwhelmed. 
by the I was emotions. happy. Yeah. Like, I was happy that I graduated because I had flashbacks of my journey. Mm. But I didn't cry while, uh, like, picking up my de- degree. <laughs> that's what I pictured. That's what I pictured. No, no, no. After I came home, yeah, yeah, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah. After I came home, the whole occasion was done. It was just me in my room. I thought, rah. And then you just start crying, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know I mean? can imagine. Yeah, yeah. But I was happy. Like, I was laughing, thinking, yo, you done it, man. Yeah, crying is a real one, man. Crying. You know what I mean? You're done it. Yeah. But I, I didn't know why I was crying. You know what I was thinking? Yo, what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, why, why am I crying, man? What's going on there? At the end of the day, it's, it's, a, it's a natural instinct, just like everything else. Just like lashing out, like laughing. It's it's one of our uh, yeah. things that we do, and but um, we have to normalize it, man. So on. that's the main thing. You have to just normalize it, and um, don't forget the way we grow up. The way we grew up was what are you crying for, man? Yeah, rugs man. Get, hey. rugs get, you know what I mean? Yeah, man. Well, yeah, well, yeah. But that I don't know. Well, I think you well, know what it, it's, it varies. You know what I mean? It's, uh, it depends. Yeah. It depends. Like obviously, yeah. I think everything has to have its right dose. Like, you know what I mean? Everything should be in between. What I said, like, everything, not too much water is not good. Too little water is not good. Anything, okay. like, too much. Moderation. Any, moderation in yeah. everything. Do you know what I mean? Like, don't how we Don't be too stiff. Don't be too extreme. Uh, yeah. Don't too soft. No, don't, don't be too, too this. Don't too be too soft, that. Not too, yo, macho, macho. Uh, um, nah, yeah, nah, I'm nah. You know what? I'll be honest with you, bro. Alpha male. Do you, <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, fair just, play. Yo, don't bring that one into this conversation, bro. <laughs> don't even start alpha that. Alpha male. Nah, nah, oh, leave oh, that there, bro. There's, I think there's, I think, for example, however macho you are, however what you are, I cry when I read Quran. So if, if that doesn't make me less macho, yeah. bro, I could cry for two hours. If I'm reading and I read the interpretation, there's tears on the page. You. Yeah. That doesn't make me less macho. You get me? You know what I mean? There's people that I've, I've had loss in my life. If I think yeah. about that person, I cry. Yeah. That doesn't make me less macho. No. It doesn't. So so I've I've realized there's 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 a difference in yeah, in variation, yes, moderation, yeah, yeah, yeah. or things like that. So, of course. so I think, but before, like you said, before I would have said, "What are you crying for, bro?" Yeah, you know what I mean. I'm getting yo. Imagine that. Well, the worst one is when you see someone crying, you don't know, you don't know. You say, oh, "Come on, man, stop crying." Cause yeah, yeah. no, but I but still you don't know what you know. What you know, yeah, 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 when someone's crying yeah, yeah, around yeah. me, I still, I still don't know how to handle it. That's a what, bit, what, a bit what, different. What, like what, obviously, what, you try to. Who says you have to handle it? No, you what don't. What do you do to that then? What do you do? I said, like like so you sit, ne- sit, sit next to me and uh, you're crying? Yeah, uh, what would you uh, do? I'll pretend like. <laughs> <laughs> no, but that's mad. That's so mad. Like, I had you. You. Are you okay, bro? Are <laughs> you no, okay or something, man? No, but if you're crying, you have to let it out. No, we understand that. Yeah, yeah no, no. What are you doing? What are you doing? You're on your phone, Instagram, scrolling. This is mad still. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. No, no, but listen. Because. Different people, and now listen. Listen to this part. Yeah. Uh, you are probably at your most vulnerable when you're crying. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. So you're not in total control of yourself, mm-hmm. isn't it? So I don't know exactly how you're going to react to a pat. Are you okay? Or you know, how, you know, come on, bro. Like you know, what I mean, anything I say, there could be an adverse reaction. So the best thing to do is let it run its course. I think that'd be so awkward. That'd be, that's what I mean. Yeah, it's someone just saying, yeah, bro. It's, it's gonna be awkward regardless. No, no, no. I think most of the time when someone cries, they're asking for a are you Support. okay? Huh. They're asking for are you okay. Uh, are you okay? Bro, bro, I need to learn how to Yeah, yeah, I need to learn how to I read people. Yeah, yeah, One guy is just there, bro. Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> you got a Wi Fi password. Any chance I get a Wi Fi password. You don't cry, yeah. Connect it for me, please. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> so hotspot on, bro, please, man. Yeah. But yeah, um, everyone's different. Well, I boys, I think it's it's been it's been a lovely conversation to say the least. Thank no, you for having us, bro. Well, no, I'm I'm, gl- I'm glad you came on. Honestly, well, I um, we've spoke about many different topics. The mental health one was real. Mm-hmm. Um, inshallah, we can get you back. Um, all of all of the scope, boys. Inshallah, no. uh, if that's okay with you, lot. If you what was it again? One thousand likes, and we get. The meaning of scope. That's it. That's it. You agree? Yeah, hundred percent. It's out there now. It's out there like that, like that. Because right, you know, Allah, yeah. I'm not gonna. I'm, I'm thinking about it till now. I'll probably find out after this interview, bro. Believe me. You will after you get a thousand likes. <laughs> no, no, I will. <laughs> I'll find out. I'll find out one yeah, way or yeah. another. But um, well, I thank you so much for coming. Actually, I want to ask you a question, if you don't mind, boys, before you leave. I'll ask you. I'll, I'll get a question for you both. So just a quick one, um, just to leave us on our. On the edge of our seats. 
So what what is the what's the one piece of advice you would give yourself ten years ago? Like if I look back now, mm. if I'm speaking to my younger self, the one thing I would say is worry less. Because everything is gonna work out. You know what I mean? Whatever is meant to happen, everything will like will will work out. And if the more you worry, the more you're not doing what you're meant to be doing. Do you know what I mean? So the one thing I always keep looking back at now is mm. basically everything heals with time. Boom. Okay. So our biggest worries last year. Two years ago, five years ago, I don't even think about yeah, it. Today. Yeah, they're nothing right now. They're nothing. It's true. So, to be honest, like just let things be and let it heal and let and time. What is pass. natural course? Let natural course, well, I and if you do that, most of the time you look back and w- with a smile and, and just reminisce. And the thing is, overthinking will like it's a th- it's the thief of joy, isn't it? Like you start thinking about things, you start. Getting becoming anxious, you start worrying, but it doesn't make any difference. Mm. So just let it run its natural course. That's good advice, bro. Uh, that's good advice, honestly. Uh, thank you for that. And Jibs, if I was to ask you, for example, uh, one question before we leave today, what is the best advice you've ever gotten? You know what? Yeah, um, it's actually a, a little reminder I have on my phone always every morning at nine a.m. Um, I, I always look at it And it comes on my phone screen On my laptop as well mm. And it, it's, it's very Very simple It just says Do everything For the sake of Allah Because If you invest in anything mm. In this dunya Everything that you do um, If you want anything That's a return investment It's doing it for the sake of Allah And I mean Not just deen related stuff Everything Helping someone Going to work Having a conversation Being kind is you always gonna get khair from it? Sah. You all you're never gonna regret it, Sah. and is is going to add up to your bank account. Well, yeah. Day of judgment, you get it. So it's something that I always try to, because in this life, it's difficult. You know, I mean, people sin. I sin. Everybody sins. You know, I mean, you always have to repent. But um, so it's just a like a marathon of you trying to. Just accumulate as many good deeds as you can But if you try to do that one thing Do everything for the sake of Allah You're subconsciously adding up to your tally You know what I mean That has been to put in sufficient effort Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah, yeah So um, This goes back to one of the reasons you asked, I never mentioned earlier was Why I wanted to do medicine was You know in Day of judgment Everyone's going to be given their book On their left hand or the right hand Everyone's going to either go to either two destinations. And I always told myself, like, Jibril, if you can make your career something that's going to help you enter Jannah, like, you've clocked life. You've clocked life already. Mm-hmm. If I help someone, if I go to work, and this person is, I'm doing it, but I know I'm doing it for the sake of Allah, number one, then, you know what I mean? I'm getting satisfaction from here. So I'm getting satisfaction mm-hmm. there as well. And just in general, if someone is arguing with me and I get angry, I'm not going to delve into it. I'm not going to like spiral down this de- degrading argument because, you know, I'm doing that for that one reason. That has helped me get out of so many altercations, so <laughs> many problems and all that. Probably be a better man as well. Yeah, and it just, you know what I mean, helped me d- make so many decisions, better decisions than I did beforehand. And, um, yeah, well, I, I have it on my phone every day. It just comes up with my notifications. It's a constant reminder. MashaAllah, that's good, man. Well, I would that. Thanks, man. Um, I've learned a lot from you guys, both of you. Uh, like I said, I wanted you on here to talk about your journey into medicine and also um, the journey of scope. But I feel like there's a lot more that we didn't speak about, um, especially with scope. So, inshallah, we can do this again. I I, I appreciate you coming down. Jazakallah um, khair for bringing us on, man. Truly appreciate it, man. Yeah, yeah. Enjoy this, wallah. No, it's good, man. It's good. You're going to enjoy it, man. It's going to come out soon, man. Guys, please, we need to make this podcast just go viral inshallah like blow he's 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 doing amazing work Allah barik he's a natural at this but you can't do nothing without so, like your community support so obviously please 
like, share, comment, engage. That's the most important thing, and it's free. So, inshallah, <laughs> it doesn't cast a thing. Inshallah. That's it, guys. After uh, hours. This has been After Hours, my dear friends, Dr. Mustah and Dr. Jibril. Are you still, you still feel? Wow, it's I'm still It's weird. massive, isn't it? It's what? still weird. It's massive, isn't it? Doctor, what? Me? <laughs> yeah, I see you double day getting a haircut. You're wearing a, what, a stethoscope. Yeah. Come on, bro. Bit, bit vain, I think. <laughs> It comes with it. I was vain. I was vain. I was vain before. So you know what I'm saying? Like, you play football with your scrubs on, bro. You got it. Yeah, yeah. It's gonna last, bro. Sleep on it, man. <laughs> now, like, guys, thanks a lot for coming. Exactly, um, this has been after hours. Make sure you like. Make sure you comment. Make sure you subscribe for more content. And make sure you engage. Make sure you engage. Let us know. Yeah, like, like bro, just safe in it. <laughs> in a bit, people, man. Love, man. Yeah, love.